Gaster Adel beoordeelt de Nederlandse X-Factor-kandidaten. She's got a really commercial voice. She does the whole Mariah hand. Tot zo. Welkom terug. I really hated you in the film. Straks een gesprek met Meryl Streep. En illusionist Hans Klok, openhartig over zijn turbulente liefdesleven. Ja, ik weet, ik weet gewoon verliefd op iemand anders. We zijn weer even terug in Londen bij de Engelse popsensatie Adele. Net als veel andere twintigjarigen is ze verslaafd aan X-Factor. I just love it. I think it's so exciting. And, and like, you don't really get to kind of have that connection with a lot of artists that you mm -hmm. like. Whereas, you kind of think, you know, you do. You feel like you know them when, when you're watching them go from like this like nervous wreck like in front of Simon Cowell to becoming like this superstar. Did you ever consider to compete yourself in, in X-Factor or Idols? No. I, I love it, but I, it wouldn't be right for me because I want. I like having control over everything I do, and I do get the impression that you don't get control over if you're a reality TV star coming from a, a talent show. Mm -hmm. I think you get told what to do, at least for like the first couple of records. But I'm so demanding, and like when it comes to my career, I know exactly what I want. Samen met Adele bekijk ik een aantal dames die door zijn naar de volgende ronde in de Nederlandse X Factor. That's Gordon. He's a Dutch singer, also. Oh, okay. And, yeah. He's our Simon Cowell. Oh, okay. Yeah. Is he horrible? A, a bit less than last year, because he was too horrible then. It sounds American. Yeah. Yeah, I like her. Yeah, like that's her. something. She's, she's very good. I love her. Her voice, she's just great, got a good, powerful voice. She looks good. Like, I don't like it when people try and dress up. Like, she looks casual, which I like. Oh, she looks nervous. Yeah, she really is. And skinny. Very skinny. Summertime. Yes. Okay. I, I think she's the best. Really? Yeah. Because she's got like, a really commercial voice. And she does the whole Mariah hand. You were just giving opinions about the contestants. Yeah. Um, do you hate it when people are critical about you? I don't hate it. I mean, I don't like, like it. No? I, don't, I don't hate it. I don't mind, you know. Yeah. And then after a while, the bigger you get, the more people know about you. And just because you're getting loved, that doesn't mean you're not going to get hated. You know, you get a lot of haters as well. You Google yourself. I used to. I don't anymore. No, because people write terrible stuff there. Oh, yeah. YouTube's the worst. Yeah. YouTube is the worst. But I have been horrible about people anonymously on YouTube. Look, so... Are you serious? I, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I can't, I can't, I can't really like, be like, oh, why do these people think that? And What I, did you write then about I'm people? I'm, oh, but I'm just like, right, oh, she's rubbish and shit. <laughs> They're so bad. Uh, about other artists? <laughs> yeah. Why did you write it on the internet? I don't know. It's just funny, isn't it? So that's why... It's I... not funny. <laughs> it's, it's, it's hurtful, I think. Yeah, but that, that's, that, it is. But that's, like, that's the nature of the internet. That's my generation. That's what we do. We, we never tell each other to our faces if we think each other are crap. <laughs> we, just go, we just go and be anonymous. Cause, and that's why it's fine. You know, I don't get upset when I read, like, oh, you know, I wish, like... Her and her whole family would die. She's so rubbish. I don't get upset because I don't know that person. I don't, I'm never going to meet them, you know. Um, and it's probably like some 13-year-old bitter little boy sitting in his bedroom on his computer having a wank. <laughs> <laughs> on your picture. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. De carrière van Adele is er een waar iedere beginnende artiest alleen maar van kan dromen. Maar dat betekent niet dat Adele nu op haar lauweren gaat rusten. Integendeel, er wordt hard gewerkt aan een tweede album. En ook op het privévlak heeft ze zo nog haar wensen. Ik wil een kind hebben. Nee. Na de tweede record. En press met deze boyfriend. Nou, ik ga niet zeggen iets over dat. Als hij het ziet, is het een mile. Als ik zeg ja. Ja, ik ga naar de volgende week. We gaan een kind hebben. No, Hoe oud is hij? Ik ga niet zeggen. 16? <laughs> That's like pedophilia. No way. Not doing that. No. Yeah. No. no. Okay. Way. I wish you all the best. Thank you. It's so I, lovely I, to meet you. Yeah, I love talking to you. Thank you. Thank you for coming over. Yeah. Guys, yeah. Okay. Thank well, you. you have to go back inside. I do. Got some meetings. Oh, busy, busy, busy. Busy, busy, busy. Terug naar.